If you're a student or if you're not a power user, then the Apple MacBook Air M4 is for you. It's the perfect alternative to the MacBook Pro. It's affordable and it's even more portable than the already portable 16-inch MacBook Pro. This is the 15-inch MacBook Air M4, which comes with 16 gigabytes of unified memory and 512 gigabytes of storage for less than $1,300. Is this the right MacBook for you? But before we get into the specifications, I want to address one thing about the MacBook Air. There are two variants, a 13-inch MacBook Air and a 15-inch one. Most of the specifications of the 13-inch MacBook Air and the 15-inch MacBook Air are the same. The only noticeable difference is that the 15-inch MacBook Air has a slightly higher screen resolution to make up for the increase in diameter. Aside from this, they are virtually the same laptop. The MacBook Air uses the M4 chip, which is a very strong chip for this laptop. It's a 10-core CPU and a 10-core GPU with a 16-core neural engine which handles and manages AI tasks. This chip is more than enough for students or regular users. For browsing, note-taking, content consumption, and a lot more, it's more than enough. However, those aren't the only tasks it can do. The MacBook Air can still handle relatively demanding tasks like photo and video editing, as well as some coding and programming. The 16 gigabytes of unified memory should also suffice for the average person. So then, what's the difference between the MacBook Air and the MacBook Pro with a regular M4 chip? Well, for starters, the 15-inch MacBook Air is about half a kilo lighter than the 16-inch MacBook Pro. And it's also thinner. This makes it easier to carry around, but it comes with a compromise. The MacBook Air doesn't have a fan and only resorts to passive cooling to keep the M4 chip as cool as possible. This will, of course, increase temperature slightly, but there's no need to worry about this since it wouldn't damage it, and there will only be a negligible performance difference compared to a regular MacBook Pro. Since MacBooks, and by extension most Apple devices, are power efficient, you can expect this MacBook Air to last practically a whole day of basic tasks, which might be important if you plan on using it in places where you might not have access to an outlet. Now let's talk about the display. The MacBook Air gets a 15-inch liquid retina display at a resolution of 2880 by 1864 pixels. It's capable of 500 nits of brightness and the display comes with a display P3 color so you get accurate colors and it also gets True Tone technology. If you're interested in displaying for an external monitor, this laptop supports up to two external displays up to 6K at 60Hz. Finally, let's talk about the ports. This laptop does not get any display ports in the traditional sense. There are no HDMI ports. However, this laptop has two Thunderbolt 4 ports just beside the MagSafe charging port to the left of the laptop. These ports are capable of outputting via DisplayPort. To the right of the laptop is a single 3.5mm audio jack. These are all the ports included in both sizes of the MacBook Air. If you're interested, all you have to do is click on the link in the description box below or simply just scan this QR code to check it out on Amazon right now. This has been Marty and I'll be seeing you on the next video. Cheers!